Hello and welcome from Ridge Oak Senior Housing here in Basking Ridge on a beautiful Sunday afternoon. I've got a few people that would like to share some thoughts about St. Mark's Episcopal Church with you today. My name is Marcella Angelou and um, I was aware I had attended some of uh, the services that Father Rick had conducted up in Falmouth Hall, but I really became acquainted with and began to know him when we did the Alpha program. And then we did the extended Alpha program. And Father Rick is definitely an exceptional uh, human being. And just talking to him, uh, being in his company, uh, just uplifts me. And there are very few times that I have attended any type of services where you come away feeling really good, you know, like you, you're spiritually fed. Well, he has that ability for me, and I think he's just absolutely great. And we're all very fortunate to have him as the pastor of St. Mark's. He is the heart of St. Mark's. And I really appreciate the fact that when we entered this pandemic, he went right to the task and he made sure that we had prayer groups that we could connect through Zoom. And so he was on the cutting edge of helping everybody through this difficult time. And it wasn't, uh, you know, he didn't give up. He just kept going and finding ways so people could connect and uh, we wouldn't feel so isolated. So um, Father Rick, uh, he's at the top of the list as far as any other clergyman that I have ever come in contact with. And God bless him and I hope that uh, we continue to have him for a long period of time because he definitely is the best of the best. Suzanne Walza. And when I was born and baptized into a family that was Episcopalians and I've grown up in the Episcopal Church, and when I moved here to Ridge Oak, I was looking for a Episcopal church in the area. <clears throat> Excuse me. And when Father Rick came for his monthly service, I immediately connected. So when I found out where the church was, I started going to chapel. I went to church a few times, but I really, it was something I could connect in the chapel. And unfortunately, when COVID came, we couldn't go anymore, but Father Rick provided a daily prayer online and our services, our Sunday services, our Wednesday services, and I really felt connected. I felt it gave me peace, it gave me comfort, and I just think that Father Rick is wonderful. The people in the church are very welcoming, they're very friendly, and I'm just very happy that I found St. Mark's Church. Thank you. Hi, and my name is Sherry Palmer, and I live here in Ridge Oak, and every day is the happiest day of my life, I have to say. Um, as far as Father Rick goes, I just wrote a few little words here, and I was wondering whether I would be able to say them to you at this time. Um, it is the reasoning behind why I am now going to church with Father Rick as the father of the priest. Okay, it's integrity, kindness, understanding, and patience. Given the new world today, we need to have more kindness, understanding, and patience to get through our days. I find the um, qualities and so much more in Father Rick. He is our lantern under our feet and walks with us every day in our life. Stay strong and stay together and have faith. That is what I feel what Father Rick and it's because of him and his in, uh, in all these abilities that he has been blessed with that I just love going to church and I love the chapel. And it will soon return. Right now we're doing Paul Wallace. I found it so interesting to do book studies. So anyway, I'm here to stay and I will be joining the church as soon as uh, I do confirmation and all that. <laughs> Thank you.